Hey YouTube, brand new tutorial from How To Tech Studio here with a new brand new release on how to make sure that your apps on a jailbroken device actually open. There's a load of apps that are crashing, so I'm going to show you how to do that, so stay tuned. Please make sure you like the video and subscribe for any tips, tricks and further tutorials. Okay, so you're going to need a couple of things. Number one, you're going to need Filezer and you're going to need a terminal app from Cydia. Make sure that obviously your device is jailbroken as well. You need that too. Um, I'm running an uh, iPhone 10 13.4.1. When you've got those two things, you're gonna to need to go to your Safari, go to the link in the description. We'll take you to this page here and click on the blue download button and then click download. And at the top there, it will start to download. When it's done, click it. Then click on the export button at the top and click copy to Filezer and it will open up. I've done it a couple of times before, but it's okay, you'll only have one there. So click the top one and then click the blue install and then click respring. Click yes. Okay, now open it back up again. Put in your passcode if you have one and then go to your terminal. Open up terminal and now you need to click S, uh, type SU and put, hit return. And now you need to put in the root password. Apple defaults this to the word Alpine, A-L-P-I-N-E, and click press return. If you've already changed the root password, then obviously put in your password, but if you haven't, then it will be Alpine. From here, you now need to type in change root FS space ampersand sign, click return. And then you can run this own space percent one. Now press return and we're good to go. OK, so we've now just run the change root FS. It's now um, a daemon on our machine. So you can now go out of this, go to your settings, go all the way down to the bottom and you will see that Kern Bypass has now been installed and you can now enable those apps. So before my Pokemon Go wouldn't work. So now I can open up Pokemon Go and then it's good to go. Thanks very much for watching, guys, and I will see you very soon. Please make sure you like and comment down below to show your support. See you soon.